Hello again, it's me. Uh, hopefully you can see me better. Um, the light up there is a bit crap, basically. It makes everything a bit dull and a bit yellow for some reason. Um, I've borrowed my daughter's lamp so to give me a bit more light and hopefully you can see me and what I'm going to show you better than if I hadn't got the light, basically the lamp. Um, Today it will be an unboxing of a game and it only came out yesterday. I would have had this yesterday if my local game hadn't have closed earlier than I expected. Um, <laughs> the strange thing was I went uh, into town and I got to the store, the game store, a bit late, uh, at 10 to 6 and I was thinking, oh, they're closed. Why? <laughs> I didn't realise they closed at 5.30pm, which is a bit stupid when you think about it. It's coming up to Christmas, wouldn't you open a bit longer? Apparently next week they will be staying open for longer, which is a bit too late because I wanted the game yesterday and they wouldn't give it me. The game is... Lara Croft. Well, Lara Croft. It's uh, Lara Croft and the Temple of Op o Osiris, or o Osiris, I think. Uh, as you can see, there, it's uh, the, the gold edition, it, and it's a box. <laughs> it's not just the average case. So, I shall get my trusty little knife, and we shall cut... The plastic makes it a lot easier than trying to get your fingers in there. Plus, I cut my nails earlier. So, cutting your nails is a good idea. Except for when you need long nails. So anyway, there we go. Um, now to try and figure out how to get this sleeve off. And just like that, the sleeve comes off. Uh, on the back is where you can see, uh, excuse if it's uh, a bit too bright, uh, because the lamp is right next to the camera, I'm afraid. So, uh, as you can see there, that's sort of what you get. You get the, the little figure. Anyway, forget about the picture, I will be showing you the real thing. So, we'll put that over there. That is the actual box art of the uh, the game and it looks like it opens this way oh well as you open it up there is the uh, the rather cute petite little Lara Croft figurine uh, this is a a map of the overworld, as they call it. So here's the figurine. As you can see, it's uh, it's, it's approximately three inches high, and it's a little cute Lara Croft figure. Um, it's rather nice. I mean, I've actually got the guns, and it's a proper little figurine. There. Um, oh, there we go, those just pop out like so. Obviously, you get the game. I mean, <laughs> wouldn't be much point in uh, not being the game. And, oh, a few bits of it there. You get this uh, rather, rather nice little book. And what this is, it's the typical type of book where it's uh, sort of artwork and uh, some concept art and stuff like that. Uh, for example, uh, one of the heroes there, uh, Isis. Um, what else do we have? Let's have a look for some concept art, such as the environment uh, there. I don't know for you. <laughs> Trying to angle it a certain way so that you can see and that it's not got the the silly shine thing off the lamp. So there we go. You get a nice little book. 
And the thing is, it, it's pretty thick. As you can probably see there, it's pretty thick. Yeah, you know, there's quite a few pages. Of, I can't tell you how many pages because there are no page numbers. So it's around 30, just over 30 pages of um, art and concept art and that. Um, in the actual case, just as I thought, uh, the disc has somehow come out of the, the holder there. Uh, what's included uh, with the game is du -du 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 the season pass, which which means you get um, bonus content, obviously. Right there, ah, it is. It. The season pass includes the key. Oh, the okay. key. Long to read, eh, man? Uh, the season pass includes the Icy Death and Twisted Gears uh, packs, which offer six additional costumes and will challenge Lara, Carter, Horse, and Isis to conquer additional tombs and collect treasure, collect a treasure trove of unique rings, amulets, and weapons. And one of the funky things I've noticed they've started doing with cases now is. Uh, you kind of have all this sort of information on the inlay there. Uh, there's the disc, obviously. Ta -da. And so uh, that's it. Now you can buy this. This costs a little bit more in store as usual because you would think they would offer the same price in store. No, no way. You always pay a little bit more. So I did pay a bit more than you would online. It's twenty four ninety nine online. From all good retailers, in game stores, you will pay twenty nine ninety nine. Uh, it's only available. This version, the gold edition, is only available on the PC and the PlayStation Four. I don't know if there's going to be uh, an Xbox One version yet. Uh, you can buy it on the Xbox One. You can buy it through uh, the Xbox Store, obviously. Um, not sure if there's a disc version. I haven't seen a disc version of it, so you probably can. I didn't see it in the shop because I didn't look. I just went straight to the counter and I said, "Give me Lara Croft." I'm not sure about the PC version. That's probably the usual five or ten quid cheaper because it's PC. Thank you for watching. If you've enjoyed uh, another unboxing of mine, please drop a like and subscribe. And. Uh, Hopefully I'll be able to do more things like this whenever I get stuff like this with collectibles and things like that because I like to show people just what you get in the uh, in the packs and whatever and uh, so yeah I will thank you for watching and 